Hey folks, this is Pirate Tiger, back playing The Swindle. Uh, I've made some adjustments to mics, input, audio balance, that sort of thing. We'll see how it works out. Um, we've had a number of deaths lately. Uh, it, uh, <laughs> we've, uh, we've been joined by a, another addition to our meat grinder, meat factory here. Um, this chap with what looks like a metal nose. I don't know, maybe he's just a bit of a dipsomaniac. Uh, Gilbert Dix! <laughs> Everybody welcome Gilbert Dick Smith <laughs> to the uh, criminal career path. Um, I think we just got to dive in. We've got a lot to get done. We've, we're only a quarter of the way through our allotted time. And we are we're approaching the point, I think, if we can just get a couple of decent runs under our, under our belt. We are approaching the point, I think... At which we can move on to the next zone and start really raking in the moolah. Um, first of all, let's get these guys dead. Oh, they make me so nervous now because the old gas thing. Yeah, um, we're going to take it slow and steady. I really want to just have some some success, you know, some written. It doesn't have to be flashy, it doesn't have to be fancy. I just want solid, good work. You know, while well, those guys are dissipating. I think I've got the... Yeah, I've got a triple jump going on. That's great. Uh, let's, oh, burst through the window, but... Um, not in time to take this guy out without him turning around. There we go. <laughs> and he even drops down into the pit. Even better. There's our security station, which is great news. Uh, it means we can start disabling things, like this electric track. Uh, our hack speed is pretty quick now, that almost went down in one go. Um, I don't really want to go up there until everything else is ooh, hello, sorted out. So, at the security station, there's only one in the level according to our um, level scanner app in the top left. And now there are none. Two in one. Like it. Uh, I don't even have to go through that. We can jump around the top. Or we can go back in here where we intended to in the first place. Right. Um, oh, there's one of those jumpy jerks. <sighs> I'm still so deeply wounded about Henry Beresford and Julia Wilde, I think. And... <sighs> Do you know what? With my triple jump, I don't need to worry about this guy. I can just whoop, whoop, whoop. Thank you very much. Uh, if I ever want to get down there, I'm going to have to uh, tackle him properly, sure. But yeah, for now, we're okay. Um, saying that, that's better. Look, it's personal now, okay? Don't question me on it. Ooh, okay. It's going to be interesting. There's a pit of spikes right below me, I think you can see. Uh, we're not going to worry about that just yet, though. Um, so what we are going to worry about is getting caught by this bird. Oh, goodness. Am I... I'm going to just prepare my uh, steam purrs, just in case. Because he's getting pretty close. Uh, yeah. Thank you very much. It's, uh, it's a very useful thing to have when you find yourself caught in a... a Compromising position. We can finally get another bug going. Uh, this has been painful, just the lack of income. Got used to having this. Uh, 48 per second coming in now. It's pretty tasty. Uh, okay. You know what? We're, we're actually getting somewhere now. Oh. And thank goodness for that triple jump. Hey, or oh, I would have been stuck down there forever. Um. Joke, we can go away. Oh, you see the trouble with taking them out is you just end up waiting and waiting and waiting. And it's not like I can steam purge my way through there. Um, it's poison gas. It doesn't just go away like that. But now it has gone. Um, this fool is going to be no problem. Thank you. Whoa! I want to stay away from that, I think. Uh, well, there's nothing... Really, I just want this cash, don't I? Because everything else there is, is meaningless to me. Okay. 
this guy. Take out this guy. Thank you. Um, another computer to get in. Am I missing huge amounts of this level? Because it seems kind of small. If I'm entirely honest. Uh, there's 14 grand left in the property. Kicking around somewhere. Uh, you would fall over and die right in front of the computer, wouldn't you? I needed that. I need to check my Facebook. Stop hissing. Okay, you good? Yeah, you're good. Right, thank you. Bit of cash. Lovely, tasty. That is really not everything, is it? What am I missing? Clearly something significant. There's at least a computer's worth of cash kicking around somewhere that I have yet to enjoy. Um, just check up here. There's not. No, there's no extra little shacks on the roof or anything. Um, it's a real problem playing this game and talking about it as you play. You find yourself missing some pretty obvious things. Um, that just goes. I can hear a bird squawking as well. There's a crow flying around and. Was it trapped in the chimney or something? What is this? Gremlins? If you get that, then you're okay. I think this room here. Yeah, okay, I get it. This room here. This is inaccessible. We need to do something about that. One bomb is not going to be enough. Fortunately, we have more than one. Let's get another one in here. And open sesame. Woo! That's my uh, Alohomora spell. You're out. You're out. There's a bit of cash over there that I do kind of want. Oh, don't come down here. There you go. Uh, this has been a very calm, almost a stately run, I would say. And with the collection of this £364 in this safe, as predicted, property.cash, as you can see in the top left, is now... Uh, sugar. <laughs> okay. I can't do this again. <laughs> I cannot go through this heartache of getting all the cash in the property and then dying at the very last. Come on. You can do it, Dick Smith, whatever your name is. Don't get a real name until you've completed a heist. Yes! Gilbert Dick Smith. What a haul. 22 grand. We wipe that place out. We get a 20 grand ghost bonus. And 10 grand aptitude bonus. Just for buying the skill. Yep. Yep, that'll do. Let's uh, pick up some tasty little toys. And head back in. Gilbert. You're my man. You'll do, you'll do. Okay. Uh, what abilities do we care about? Uh, none of this really important. I mean, we could earn a little more money from from the hacks, I guess. But um, I think... Oh, the bugs. Bugs. I can afford a bug. The, honestly, guys, the bugs are really where it's at. This is where the money definitely... Whoop. Excuse me. Making that sort of mistake. This is where the money starts rolling. We're going to have two bugs on the go at any one time. And the later we get into the game, the more the bugs are worth because we start laying them near more and more expensive computers. Uh, we can afford a computer locator app that identifies any nearby computers. Um, I don't think we can afford much else that's of any real value. I don't really care about the computer locator app though. So, I'm not going to bother. I think we'll just take what money we have and head back into the abyss. New Belgravia. Before long, we're going to stop robbing rich folk and we're going to head on to where the real money is, the casinos. Now, we've got cameras. Bad. But we have a security station. Good. One security station means... Oh, <laughs> and it's so accessible as well. Uh, oh, crumbs. Didn't spot him. Yes. 
don't like dropping down into places like this. I think we're going to be better advised. Oh, so picturesque. This is another little airship. I think we're going to be better advised just uh, coming down this side. And in fact, let's make this even easier on ourselves. Clonk, clonk. Get out. And the brute is out. Uh, we do have an explodey jerk here. I don't know what they're called. Oh, I'm a little afraid actually. If he sets off next to that security station, he might blow it up. So, let's open the door and run away. No! Okay, he didn't blow it up. That's okay. Come out here. Come out here! Thank you. Oh. You weren't long for this world anyway, my friend. Not once I got my hooking on. I wonder, since those, uh, since these cage guys, they don't have a vision cone or anything around them? They don't have a light, uh, a sight line? I don't know if, uh, the Steam Purge, my brief cloak of invisibility, will, uh, be of much use with them. It'll be interesting to test, but I'm not gonna try it now. Uh, whoop! Bye! Goodbye! Ah! Woo! <laughs> uh. Back here. I've got words with you! Yes! <sighs> I feel sick still. <laughs> the tension is really hurting me. Oh, so many bugs we have. Oh, let's get this one down. 51 pounds a second. We're earning almost 100 pounds a second for nothing, for just sitting here. It's great. This tool is blocking the doorway. There's no way I can get in. Fortunately, I don't give a tiny toss about that doorway. Because I just want to go further in. Um, this is a tricky spot. But. If we blow away in here, we might not have to deal with it. I wonder if that... Can we detonate that mine? Are we near enough? I don't think we are. It's fine. It's fine. We're going to blow away in. Let's get this bomb down. Because I think this spot will be far more accessible for us than... Yeah, that'd be great. Oh, this is almost custom made for us now. This is much more accessible than up there, where we could only drop onto a, a podium in a sea of spikes that was visible to everyone. Um, yeah. I don't want to take any risks, so... Ooh, maybe I am close enough to detonate the mine now. Yeah! <laughs> Goodbye, my friend. Boom. And he's out. And so are the spikes. It's a nice little side effect. Uh, he can't even see over here, so... I'm just going to drop a bug. Yeah, I'm good. And... Back the computer. So good. So look down here, what have we got? Bit of a mess, but nothing we can't handle. In fact, I think we can just drop down now. Uh, just saying that. <laughs> I'll just wait a minute, I think. Um, oh, got myself creeping down there. As soon as these guys are out of the way again, oh, this jumpy jerk gets, gets off and does want to go. It's handy that these guys seem to move at the same speed, actually. Yeah, let's get down now. Clonk. Clonk. Uh, not enough. Uh, I think what I'll do is get up here and then get ready to detonate these fools. Oh, I'm starting to feel like an action hero. Like I am tooled up, guys. Who is that lad in the Goonies? Um, who had all the fancy tools and tricks and, you know, squirted oil out of his heels and I don't know what he was playing at, honestly. But uh, it seemed to work. Another computer. This might be the last computer, actually. And um, that's good. It's just a little smidgen of cash. 162 pounds. It's not much at all. I think it might be one of those uh, those bags of cash. So if we can just grab that and run. We are basically done. Like so. <laughs> I think that's it. I think that's the bag of cash. Right at the exit. In and out, guys. In and out. Smooth as silk. Ghost run. Lay two bugs. 
Man, Angel Court is ours. XP is increasing. The money is rolling in. This is going so well. Back to the airship. Just, just before we wrap up this episode, let's see what it's going to take for us to advance to the casino stage. A hundred thousand. We're not far off affording that. What do you guys think? We're going to have to do another run in the uh, in New Belgravia one way or another. But is there anything we desperately want before we make that move? Let me show you something. The auto steam purge. If detected, your backpack will automatically lose a momentary purge of its steam capabilities. It's not cheap. 120 grand. I don't think we can afford it yet. I think we've got to move on to bigger and better game first. But that is so nice. It's it's like a get out of jail free card. You know, you get one use per heist and it will discharge when you're spotted, making you unspotted, as it were. And that can change your game. It really can. It vastly increases your survivability. Anything else, though, that might be of use to us before then? Um... This is nice, the hack aptitude. Yeah, let's get that. Let's, uh, you know, improve our, uh, improve our interest, as it were. Um, and you know what? Let's get the scrapyard as well. Thieves with higher XP and in districts with a higher security clearance will see higher returns on the scrapyard, which is an investment in the city's scrapyard. A financial return direct to your bank account for each dead bot. That's right. We earn money just for taking guys out. And only 25 grand. It wasn't worth it in the early levels because uh, the bots wouldn't give us too much in return, but I think this will pay for itself quite quickly. And it's not wiping out our account. We need to earn 100 grand in total. We need that in our account in order to move on to the casinos. So for only 66 grand, we can take this game to the next level. With our XP boost, with our scrapyard, with our hack attitude increase. All of these are going to vastly increase our earnings. I think we're going to be able to do it. Join me next time, folks, as we make one last run into the mansions of the rich class. Bye!